Okay, suppose that the area of a circle is 740 square inches. We want to know what's the diameter of the circle to the nearest inch. All right, so there's our circle. The area is equal to 740. That's given to us. Now, one thing we'll want to use is the area formula for a circle, and that is pi times the radius squared. Recall that the radius is the distance from the center of the circle out to one edge. We're going to approximate pi by using the value 3.14. So the idea is we're going to be able to use this information about the area to solve for the radius. And recall that the diameter, the diameter is actually the distance all the way across the circle. So once we get the value for r, we'll simply multiply that by 2, and that's going to give us the diameter. All right, so we've got 740, again, because that's the area. That equals 3.14 multiplied by r squared. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to divide both sides by 3.14. That's going to leave us with r squared on the right side. So here I'm going to use my calculator. So let's see, 740 divided by 3.14. I'm getting that to be 235.668, so I'm going to round that to 0 0.67. And now to get r by itself, since r is being squared, we're going to take the square root of both sides. Now normally for an, algebra, you know, an algebraic equation, when you take the square root of both sides, you have to include a positive and negative on uh, one side of the equation, but in this case, you know, so taking the square root of r squared is going to give us r. The radius clearly has to be positive, so I'm only going to keep the positive solution. So let's see here. I'm going to take the square root of 235.67. I'm getting that to be 15.35 after rounding. So that's the radius. Okay, so we said that the diameter, that's going to be twice the radius. We have to double that. So the diameter is going to be 2 multiplied by 15.35. That's going to give us 30.70 after uh, doing the arithmetic. So 2 times 15 is 30. 2 times 35 is 70. So that's where I'm getting the 30.70. And since we're rounding that to the nearest, uh, we said to the nearest inch, the diameter is roughly going to be equal to 31 inches.